Hello YouTube, it's Incredible Mango, this is episode number 17 of the Pokemon Fire Red Randomizer Let's Play. So let's go straight into it. I think most of the level, uh, most of this episode is going to be leveling up and seeing if we can get another recipe on. Alright. In prep for our Lieutenant Surge battle. Pretty sure we'll get next to nothing if we're killing a magic harp. No, 28, there we go. <laughs> in, comparison, in comparison to the 400 and something we got for the Espeon. Okay, and obviously they're quite common, so I'm not even going to waste my time with magic harps. As soon as we see a magic harp, we're just going to run. As you real, as you real, I don't want you to go away. I want something decent that can learn dig. Yay! That's what you want. Right, let's do this again. See how far we get this time. we could do with a new Pokemon, it's been like four episodes since we've caught something anything. I hope to god it can learn dig, um, can learn dig. Oh, it's all in vain. It's pathetic, it uses that all the time. It's brilliant, it's just what we need. Alright, that's going to lower down its speed. If we send out. Send out Flaffy, we can Thunder Shock it. And paralyze it. <laughs> it really is as useless as an Eevee. It knows nothing decent. Helping Hand. And. Sand Attack. Okay, so let's paralyze that will improve our chances of catching it. Oh my god, that's a well cool ability. Synchronize. I love that idea. That's brilliant that it knows that it can do that. I really want it now. Very weak. Damn it, we missed. Let's get it down to the red and we'll do the three poke wall. Okay, we're a little bit go a little bit redder than that. Technically it is in the red, but I want it to go even lower than that. So far it's only attack, offensive attack and do one damage a, t a hit. I could probably get away with one more if I don't, if it, unless it's a critical. Hopefully it isn't going to be, this one won't be a crit. If it's a critical then we're screwed. Oh, we missed! Oh no! Come on please, one more. No! Oh, damn it, we killed it! Oh well. We'll get the Fluffy will level up. We should. Yep. Okay, let's try and get another one. A magic up. 
second one that. Uh. Yeah, hey, we got another one straight away. A sixty. Now this one's a better level. Brilliant. Well, it's equally as rubbish, but real. <laughs> oh, that one slide. Confusion, why has it not been using that? That's a massively powerful move compared to what it's been using. Oh, I want it even more now. No, 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 don't feel like all yet. Chill your boots, love, let's go for this. Oh, I'm so happy, forget it. To make up for that Porygon. Don't kill me, please. Oh no, now it's confused me as well. Damn it. I'm paralysed and confused. Just use a thunder wave. No! I'm going to do a thunder wave. I don't need to thunder wave it, but I'd like to. Yes, this should be a thunder wave. If you send wave, yes, right. Now onwards, it'll be three Pokeballs. We've got to be able to get it now, surely. Go, okay, let's throw these Pokeballs. Pokeball one is a... Escape, damn it. I can't wait till we get some great balls and get a bunch of regular poker balls or some ultra balls we'll do. Poker ball number two is a run. Damn it! Right, how many poker balls have I got? I can't attack it anymore. Ten, like I'm gonna use another five, and if it's not caught within five then I'll kill it. One, two, three. We got it! Yes! Third Pokeball. That's my rule as usual. If the first two don't catch it, the third one will. And it's, yet yeah, again, that theory's been proven. So, transfer to PC. Right, let's run down and get it and see if we can learn dig. Well, hey, we got an Espeon. Oh, we've got a gym battle, a trainer battle, damn it. Okay, so even if we don't, it can't then dig, I'm going to add that to the party, because it's a very cool Pokemon to have in the party. If it was an Umbreon, it'd be better, but... Espeon's pretty sweet. I'm happy with that. Why has Butterfly got, Butterfly got such a big head? What was up with the sprite for this? Somebody was given the job to design a sprite art, and they'd given a Butterfly a massive head.
I wonder if the stone evolutions work randomly as well. So I've got an Eevee in the box, haven't we? If we've got a, a Firestone or something, whether it would still be a Ferran or whether it would become something completely random, whether that's that remained. Because it's still technically uh, evolution in terms of the game file. And that should be random. Randomised. Oh, damn it. This one, then we're gonna send out Flappy. But it failed, yes. Oh, this should be a crit. Ah, oh, damn it, it's paralyzed. No, forgot about that. Get one crit and, we're, and then we've done it. Oh, kidding me, right? Let's just do this. Come on, Flappy. Don't kill yourself. Thunder shock here. Yeah. That did, um, it was a critical and it did that little damage. What the fuck? WTF, what the fuck? I'm well amazed how little damage that's doing. Okay, it's got us now, that we're gonna die on that one. I thought I could have swore supersonic damaged you as well as... Okay, yeah, we're going to kill ourselves. Damn it. Damn. Um, who do we need to level up the most? Um, Tauros. Sphere, because we want to evolve it. We'll send Sphere out. Body slam. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. I was blowing my nose. I didn't think you really wanted to hear that down the microphone. Oh, let's go and look at this Espeon. And we're at 30. We're not even halfway through an episode and I've got a new Pokemon. This is good. Oh, I don't know who I'm going to get rid of. Probably Mr. Mime. So we need Tauros because it's he's lost that's our that's our um, new starter Pokemon. So we can't really get rid of him. Flappy's useful. Tillery's definitely useful. Blossom knows Cart and Seal is our Charmander in disguise, so we have to be Mr. Mime. Mr. Mime joins the party So he's now living with Eevee to and Take a peek. Continue box operation, no. Right, I want to withdraw a Pokemon. Yeah, oh, and Lunatone's in here too, of course, we've dumped Lunatone in here. Okay, let's just withdraw Espeon. Let's have a look at Espeon, see what Espeon's... Alright, so... Alright, come out of that. 
let's have a look. Espion should be healed as well because it's gone straight into the box, yeah. It's got 51 HP. Steel type. Synchronize, yeah, passes on stage problems, that's cool. There's confusion, tail with a. Right, let's have a look at if it can then dig. This is the important bit. I'm hoping it can, but I don't want don't in theory it should be able to, but uh, we'll see. Let's have a look. Dig. Use. Yes, it's able to. Yeah, we want it. Right, so we'll get rid of helping hand. Because it's absolutely pointless for this for this um, game. Yes, we've got a decent Pokemon that knows a decent move that will help us with the surge. Ground type would have been better because then we've obviously not, we can't take it, it, we can't be damaged by electric Pokemon, so we'd have been you know um, invincible to the surge. But we'll settle for the for that SPR. Let's just go and train it up a bit. That's it. Right, let's go to this. Oh, we didn't we didn't heal our two little friends here. Oh no. Well, I'm going to train this Espeon up, so let's just go straight with it. I need to get it to at least a level 20. Pokemon's on the hook! Oh my god! I was only level 5, of course, yeah. That would have been brilliant. Don fan. A bloody Don fan. Of all the things that we could have got at level 5. That would have been awesome if that had been at a decent level. And it's down. It <laughs> looks so dodgy. <laughs> I love the animation. Rip it out. <laughs> Yeah. Not even a nibble. <laughs> Story of my life. Laugh it out, not even a nibble. Hey, Pokemon is on the hook. Hey! Dragon air, but it's, got, it's obviously it's going to be crap because it's uh, the old rod. And the old rod's only going to give us level 5 maximum to the upgrade to super rod. But we're gonna get quick kills so um, we should maintain decent experience which we uh, 102 is not too bad. If somebody retextured that with skin colour that, that would look so wrong. And no doubt somebody has. There's plenty of wrong people out there. Polywell! It's the first one with them we've seen. We haven't seen a Polywell yet. Yeah. Nice to have seen it, and now we'll kill it. Right. Let's go back into this horrible cave and see if we can find. Something decent to fight. In fact, if we stand here, we use uh, Blossom to call something into us. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? A pseudo Wudo! Pseudo Wudo!
schon kein Wunder. It's a bit late for that, so I'm gonna now kill it, so try to use that on the last move. Digging them. What? It knows rest. Are you kidding me? I can't even catch it because it's a legendary. And I've made that rule of no legendaries. Decent amount of experience. Okay, we're gonna have to jump out of battle and try to change Pokemon. I'm gonna have to do an experience share. separate PC monitor displaying this so that I don't have to keep going through the sheet, I just actually type it in. But I haven't around to setting that one up yet, so you have to bear with me guys. I'll just look manually via paper. There we go, it's a psychic. Okay, so it's now a psychic, sorry, I, I believe it was a psychic to start with, so that's nothing changed, so it's remained the same. So for psychic we need a bug, dark or ghost. Dark, okay, we'll send out it's a bit late now. We should we could have sent out our Tauros because he knows suit, which is dark. Um, what's weak? So don't use steel. No, sorry. Don't use fighting or psychic, which isn't really relevant to have got either of them, so Right now, it better give me at least 400 spread across the two. So that's, yeah, that was pretty good actually. 261, so 261 twice, so that's uh, well, over 400. It's nearly 600. So if we find another one of them, that's worth it. 
A pseudo Wudo! Dig into the ground. Out. I think another Jirachi would be sick, but Mr. Mime. Alright guys, let's come out of here, we'll go to that little bit of grass to the right of this area and see what we've got in there. Got four minutes remaining on the timer. So we could possibly get a Pokemon battle involved in that, but I've got very little health. So I'd rather not. Technical! That'd be rubbish, so we're not even going to bother with it. Give us no experience. Or next to nothing at least. Tangela, they're good for experience. We learned that last time. I think it's 400 for them. So that's that's worth the fee. This is a well powerful Espeon. I'm well glad we got it. Right, let's see if we can get one more level in the next two minutes. <gasps> oh my god! I did not expect that. That was... It's a crap level. But if we kill it... Oh my god. So we have found a Blastoise, and now a Venusaur. The amount of rubbish we've had from this area, and we've suddenly just got a Venusaur. That was such a shock. It's a very tough Venusaur at that. But it looks so cute! It looks like one of my beardies. With a flower on its back. It's so cute. I was very tempted to print off a flower now and stick it onto my beardy's back. With like a little, like a little backpack. I'm sure she'd love that. She probably would let me. She's quite dopey. It, but I just know it's not worth it because it's a, it's a level 11 and it's not going to revolve. What's it going to give us? 326. Yeah, we leveled up with a second left on the clock.
That was bang on. Excellent, so now we'll do a usual return to Pokemon Center. I'll save. And I will do a little to so we'll get ready for the next episode. Let's go up here. So what have we managed here? We've got let me just have a quick recap. We've got Espeon up to level 18, so we've two more levels for Espeon. And Fluffy, I believe, needs to go up another level. What's Fluffy at? Level. Where do we find the level? Oh, 21. Okay, so Fluffy's good. So we just need to do Espeon up two more levels, which will easily be done in the next episode in that little patch of grass. So yeah, cheers for watching guys, it's been Flavor Mango, let's heal our Pokemon and I'll see you all in the next video.